Following breaking news out of Miami, that's where police tell us yachts caught on fire overnight. Local 10 Sarah Onward, she's at that scene right now with what we're learning this hour. Sarah. JC and Eric, we know this all started around 2.30 when Miami police called in these two yachts on fire to Miami Fire Rescue. This was an hour long firefight, but crews are still on scene here putting out hot spots. You can see the two yachts being sprayed from a fire boat right now. One of these yachts is about 70 feet long. The other about 50 feet long. Again, this fire boat right now is putting out hot spots. The smoke and flames have since been uh, contained. I'll take you to some video submitted from Miami Fire Rescue right now. Uh, they say that when they arrived, these flames were about 70 feet in the air, and this was a very intense firefight for that hour when 17 fire units arrived to the scene, and they were putting out this fire both from the 22nd Avenue Bridge and from that fire boat. I'll take you to our ground video now from when we first arrived. Uh, Again, several units were on scene uh, in the fire boat, also from the bridge, putting out these flames. They were all, there was also a hazmat crew on scene dispersing foam to this area. I'll let Lieutenant Pete Sanchez from Miami Fire Rescue tell you why that was necessary. The conditions were intense. That's why we had multiple units uh, from the bridge, from the water and land. It also, you're dealing with a lot of fuel, a lot of plastics. So we also had to use the foam operation. That's why our hazardous materials team was here. So thankfully right now Miami Fire Rescue says that no one seems to be on board those two yachts. They are working to get in contact with the yacht owners, also the marina owner. But again, no one was injured. No uh, first responders were injured either. But again, this was a very intense firefight still ongoing, putting out those uh, hot spots. You can see firefighters still on scene this fire boat is still working hard as far as this uh, 22nd Avenue bridge here. It was closed during the firefight, but it is back open to traffic. There are cars uh, going on in both directions on this bridge, but fire investigators are out here trying to figure out how this all started. As soon as I get updates, I will pass them on to you for now reporting live in Miami this morning. Syrah onward local 10 news.